Hey guys, it's Pauline. I have another haul. Now this is one of the um, things that came in today that I am very excited for. I've been waiting for. Um, I got a couple more things that's coming. I hope eventually because there I've made an order for Hobidichi, uh after everybody else did like the big orders and stuff. And I have been getting a lot of trouble trying to get it. But uh, we'll go over that, I guess, whenever it gets here, if it gets here. But second to that, this I have been waiting for. Okay, so let's look and see what we got here. Um, I forget what this is. I hope this is something crafty. So y'all won't have to sit here and watch me open a brush or something. All right, let's see. Oh, I think. So, something weird happened yesterday. I hadn't had this happen before. I bought two pens um, from Amazon. And one of them was supposed to come in last night. And I was looking at the tracking and it said that it was on the way and it was going to be delivered today and then all of a sudden they said that they gonna uh return it back to the sender and issue me a refund it was apparently it was on the truck or maybe they thought it was and then they get here and it wasn't but it was weird and so um they said that well it had to be actually on the truck or something because they showed the package going back to the FedEx facility, which is weird, but it must have got damaged or something. And so they're going to go ahead and issue me um, a refund. And I just thought I'd mention that because I thought that was so weird. And I wonder if uh, other people have had that happen to them too. But what made me think of that was uh, this is a uh, fountain pen, I think. And then the other one was a fountain pen. And it's just, I, I don't use fountain pens, but it, uh, I don't know. I thought that I would try one. And I was watching different YouTube videos and they were saying which ones you should start with. So I ordered a couple of them and the, they're not, they're not expensive. Yeah. Like this, this is one of the ones that everybody almost almost everybody says you should start with it's the lamy so oh man is that hmm okay so i think they had yeah they had a fountain pen and they had a ballpoint pen i think and so this is the ballpoint one that's a bummer <laughs> but um anyway let's see Oh, that's nice. Well, this must be gel. Because that... It feels nice, though. So, I thought that I would try each one of these. And I, this wasn't, like, real expensive. I don't remember what it is. It's really lightweight and all of that. So, but I thought it was... I really like the aesthetics of it. So, anyways. And then it'll fit... In like your traveler's notebook pockets and stuff like that. So, not the pockets, but you know what I mean. Like, when I was saying pockets, I was saying traveler's notebook, but I was talking about this. I've seen people sit it in this. Like that. But anyway, so I was talking about a case. Alright, so let's move on. So I do have like one more coming. It was supposed to be like um not like the cheapest you can get, but then again, nowhere near expensive. Okay. It's more like one of the higher cheap ones, if that makes sense. It was like twenty dollars, I think. Okay. Alright, so I got a couple of um stamps from Studio Calico and this one I think is a bring back like it sold out years ago well maybe it was last year and then they brought it back 
this one i am very very happy to pick up on i thought it was super cute and when they were showing it online it almost looked like a six by eight but i like that it's very tiny and um you could put it in your planner and stuff like that it's super cute i like this a lot and this one so far is sold out but you know if they get more requests for these, I'm sure they'll bring it back. But right now, it's sold out. And then this one. So, the other day, I was trying to remember if the stamp set I had was Allie Edwards or was it Studio Calico. It's because I remember seeing this. And I was like, wait a minute. I know I saw this on Studio Calico. So, let me go grab that one. That... I'm talking about and you'll see why I got confused okay so that looks similar so this is the one from Ellie Edwards this is the one from uh, Studio Calico and I remember she and that Mary so it's different um so like the R and then the R Y but here you got R R and then Y so, you know, it's different. But I remember seeing that wonky Mary. <laughs> so, this is super cute. Um, I can see where you can put different things in those O's. I, I really, I, I love both of these. So, I'm very happy to get it. All right. And that's all we had to show on that one. And um look like they're coming out with different packaging on uh, Studio Calico is. Okay. And then then this one. I can't wait to get to this one. So I only kind of cut it on the sides. Now let's see. My Tim Holtz scissors. I have used this. I've had these for years. I love these scissors. Okay. And they still cut like butter and I do stuff like this opening packages with it and stuff all right so let's see what we have here so travelers goodness this um I wouldn't recommend this this was expensive and Silly, but I don't know. Just had to, just had to do it. And after my other stuff come in, that I mean, guys, this really is it. <laughs> Cause I mean, you can't sustain this kind of stuff. But anyway, let's look at this. All right. And um, this came pretty fast. Let's see. So we got a return policy there. Um, breast exam. I like that a lot. I'm so happy that they um, did this. That's nice. Okay. And just in case I forget, they gave me two return policies. Okay. So let's see. So we got the um, passport size, the craft pockets. So I plan to put like little stickers. Oh, I have like um, some orders from Coffee Monkey, Coffee Monsters Co. And then there's this other one that I didn't even know about until I saw a YouTube video, of course. And um, so I have quite a bit of little um stickers coming so i plan to put them in here all right and then so we talked about how i bought some from amazon and then i had bought some from travelers now this is the travelers notebook one i'm just waiting on this passport one to put it in and um, so this is the second one and then we have the I think this is no this must be the regular yeah the dark red one I was thinking maybe this was craft 
but this is the regular dot grid one and let's see and then i really really wanted this so um so you can hold your book open and stuff so i was really excited to get this it was uh, not cheap it was 18 dollars just for a clip but um very very nice they had one that, that just had Traveler's Notebook Company and stuff like that. But I wanted the one with the um with this image on it. And you know how things just look bigger? This looked bigger to me. <laughs> but anyway, um I've heard other people say that it doesn't um scratch up your notebooks and stuff like that. So I went ahead and get picked that up. And then this is the same zipper pouch thing, but it's for the standard size because I tried to decide whether or not I wanted the passport or I wanted the standard size. I like them both. And so I, I was just ripping myself apart trying to figure out, okay, do I want this one? Do I want that one? Then, uh, I don't know. I clicked them both. So, um, so I had to get inserts for them both. I didn't have to, but you know, that's what my brain said. Okay, so we have, this one is dot grid, just regular dot grid. And then we have this one, let's see what this one is. So, this is free diary. Here we go. Yeah, these are undated. So you got the, uh, you had the monthly views, then you got the weekly views, and then you have a whole section over here to uh, put whatever you want. And so for me, this says you don't have to uh, keep this up. You can write in it whenever you want. So I think this notebook is actually going to be for when I travel. So, um, I mean, we don't do a whole lot of traveling. We maybe go to a couple of staycation uh, spots a couple of times a year, but we're, we're not, yeah, we don't have it like that. Okay, so here is what I really am excited about. This is the one I definitely, definitely was going to get. And then this one, I just... I just couldn't stand it, so I went ahead and got that one, too. Now, there was one that I really wanted, but they were out of stock. Everybody was out of stock, so I went ahead and settled on this one. But the other one that I really wanted was uh, the record one. But I really like this one, too. <laughs> so, let's look at this. I don't want to tear the box. Because you know how we are about tearing boxes and stuff. Let's see, keeping packaging and stuff like that. Because this, I believe, will collapse. And so you can put it in like your pro Project Life spreads, stuff like that. So it'll probably find its way in there. Okay, and look at that cute box. So I'm definitely going to be keeping this box. Isn't that pretty? so excited so I really wanted that one but I'm happy to have this one and then I got that one didn't get this one but this one was really cute too but um you know you can't do it all right so let's look at the stickers I know that these are stickers because I've seen people unbox this and these stickers are really really cute they're nice and thick not too thick and they got gold foiling i thought they were more than these but anyway i'm very excited i almost can't stand it and then of course we're going to keep the envelope and of course the envelope is going to go in um in um 
scrapbooking, right? All right, and then, oh, I think this is the charm. <clears throat> so, take a look at this. Yeah. And there it is. It's so cute. And this will go along the little uh, elastic band. It'll move. And let's take a book. If it's going to focus. Very, very cute. All right. We have that. And then, okay, that's just a filler. And then, I thought these were super cute. I'm a stamp person, of course. And... The, these were must-have. Isn't that cute? They're already mounted. Perfectly mounted. I love it. I absolutely love it. Alright. And then... And then the actual book. So let's see. So, this is some kind of pamphlet. I guess it's telling you how to keep it clean or something. Oh, telling you what you can get to go with it. Alright. And then, so the extra band is gray. And then... We have the, the bag. Super cute. And then we have the notebook. It is so much cuter in person. I think this looks different than what I saw. I don't know. <laughs> but I am very happy about this. But I have seen some people say that over time this will flake off. And I'm already stressing about that. But I'm trying to be okay with that. And um, this is so cute. And then you got the debossing on the other side. And then, alright, so we already have the notebook. Um mounted in here and look at that love it now the rest of the pages are blank except for the end because i've seen people unbox this and there you go and then that's so cute i'm just giddy right now <laughs> so this is going to i plan to be my uh actual wallet and i have a galen leather wallet that's going to go on the inside of this and so this is going to replace my um my wallets that i have right now and then i'll just jot down um like what I spent or grocery list or whatever. So that's that one. That one is going to be with me um, all the time. All right. And then this one. Super cute. All right. Sorry about the noise. The box makes it feel huge. <laughs> so we got another box. I'm gonna be keeping, of course. So the accessories I'm not using at the time will go in this box. I'll probably keep the whole the whole notebook until I actually go somewhere 
in this box. All right. Let's see. Did I, did I show you the... I know I showed you the front. Did I show you the back? I don't think so. And I'm sorry how long this this video is. I wasn't meaning to have this long of a video. All right. And then, let's see. got this super cute then we got some stickers let's take a look at those really like these oops they're so cute that I'm probably going to stress over how I'm going to use them so I won't waste them They're pretty. I'm very excited. Now this one comes with a lot more stickers. Very cute. I'm very happy about the stickers on this one. All right, and then let's see. Okay, this must be my charm. Too. So this goes on like the end, like um, the end of it, and then this goes on the band. Oops, am I in frame? Okay, I think this goes on like the bookmark. No, it's this goes on the outside, I think. But anyway, all right, and then there's just a pencil. I hate it that this one didn't come with a stamp or something. They just give you a pencil. I think that's kind of a cop out. <laughs> but anyway. This is cute. Alright. And then the actual notebook. info about what all comes in it and then what you can get extra all right and then so this band is kind of like a peach i guess color and one of the things that i really liked about this one I thought this was super cute that it's a laundry bag. I thought that was super cute. And then, oh, that is so pretty. That is so pretty. Now, it doesn't, uh, yeah, I say this all the time that it, um, the video didn't give it, didn't do it justice. It really doesn't. So, this is a rose gold. And it is so pretty up against this chocolate. It's so pretty. I'm very, very happy. All right. And then the back. All right. Look at there. It's scratched already. But anyway, I have, I'm trying to resign myself to be okay with the scratches. Because it's going to do it. And... I have to be okay with this eventually wearing off. All right. Oh, this feels so nice on the inside. Now, 
my favorite as far as feeling is the um the other plain passport in camel that thing it feels wonderful but these are nice but the other one is by far the best okay so we'll look at this so that's the inside and then they're all blank and this is very very nice paper and then we have this we have a menu and in the back of the luggage super cute y'all so um both of these are the same they they're the same color okay so that is everything so i just thought that i would oh this just looks like a giant mess but i thought i would um share with y'all what i picked up and i'm waiting on a a uh, couple more accessories and then I'll show you what I do with it. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.